Hey everyone, welcome back to AI Expert. Today I've got something really interesting for you, a powerful tool called Tenorshare AI Bypass. If you're someone who uses AI tools like ChatGPT, Gemini, or Claude to generate content, you might have faced a big issue. AI detectors picking up your work as artificial, even when it's top notch. That can be frustrating, especially for students, freelancers, or content creators trying to pass AI checks. But don't worry, this tool claims to humanize AI content and make it completely undetectable by AI detection tools. Sounds impressive, right? But does it really work? In this video, we're going to test it out together explore all the features and see how well it performs in real world scenarios by the end you'll know whether tenorshare ai bypass is worth your time or not first log into your account once you're signed in you'll see an interface like this on the left side you'll find three main options ai bypass paste your text here to convert it into human-like content ai detector it kind of check if your content is detectable by ai tools History, view and access your previously converted text. Let's get started. I'm opening ChatGPT and asking it to generate some content for us. I entered 150 words of AI generated content into the tool to test how well it works. Now I'm copying the content and pasting it into zero GPT. Then I click on the scan button to check if it's detected as AI generated. As you can see, Zero GPT has successfully scanned the content and the result shows that it's 100% AI generated. This means the text is easily detectable by AI detection tools and wouldn't pass as human written. Now let's use Tenorshare AI bypass to humanize this content. I'm copying the AI generated text and pasting it into the tool. Let's see how well it converts this into natural human-like writing. In the center panel, you'll see two key options. Halastio's mode and tone. Mode lets you choose how much the content should be changed. Next to it, we have the tone option, which controls the writing style. You can choose from tones like now I'm selecting the fast mode. After that, I'll click on the check for AI button to see if the tool has successfully reduced AI detection. You can see the analysis results here. At the top, there's a clear warning saying, the input content is likely AI generated. Below that, various AI detectors like GPT-0, ZeroGPT, Smodin, Ternitin, and CopyLeaks have all marked this content with a red indicator, confirming that it's not human written. To convert this AI generated content into a more human like version, we'll simply click on the humanize button. As you can see, the tool has started processing the content. In just a few seconds, you can see that the tool has successfully converted our content into a human-like version. As you can see, after humanizing the content, tools like GPT-0, Zero, Zero GPT, CopyLeaks, and others are now detecting the text as human-written. This confirms that the Tenorshare AI bypass tool has effectively rewritten the content to bypass AI detectors. Now let's check how much of the content has been humanized. We'll simply copy the humanized text, paste it into zero GPT and click on the detect text button. And here's the result. Zero GPT shows 0% AI, which means the content has been completely humanized. This confirms that the rewritten text is now natural enough to pass AI detection tools without raising any red flags. Now that our content is fully humanized and has passed all major AI detection tools, we can safely copy and use this content anywhere, whether it's for blogs, academic writing, assignments, website copy, or even professional emails. Since it's no longer being flagged as AI generated, there's no risk of rejection or credibility loss, and it reads just like something written by a real human. And that brings us to the end of this video. We explored how Tenorshare AI Bypass works, tested it with 150 words of AI generated content, and saw how it transforms robotic text into something much more human and natural. If you're someone who creates content using AI tools like ChatGPT, Claude, or Gemini, and you're worried about AI detectors flagging your work, this tool might just be what you need. But as always, use it responsibly and ethically. Have you tried any AI bypass tools before? 
Did this one impress you or are you still skeptical? I'd love to hear your thoughts. If you found this video helpful, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe so you don't miss out on the latest AI tools, tips, and reviews. Thanks for watching. Stay smart, stay creative, and I'll see you in the next one.